Hello everyone, I'm Jérôme Courroy, Global Business Development Manager for Dessouter Aerospace 4.0 Solutions. So we're here today to introduce you to the Dessouter range of solutions and show you how these solutions can help you improving your uh, processing in the aerospace factories. So for that, we've split it, this Dessouter ecosystem in five main red cores. So connected assets, which is a really important focus, covering for manual drilling, semi-automated drilling, as well as manual tightening process control solutions which make sure that all the different steps are respected according to the requirement of the method engineering team. Then the motion capture which is providing this critical information about where each one of the tool is at any time with a six degrees of freedom in your factory. The use of data with the Demeter solutions and the system integration which will be focusing on making sure all those uh, tools and solutions work together as well as bringing the light automation uh, solutions into the focus. Now let's move to the real demo. So this is uh, the typical aerospace process. So to do this we'll use the different uh, tools and as, a, as an operator I'll need to follow uh, the uh, sequence which, which is provided to me uh, by the process control software. It could be done by a display, by a laser, it could be done by a tablet or it could be done by augmented reality glasses. So now I will move on and do my first hole. I send the information directly to my process control software and I drill the second hole. So now I'm ready to install the drill jig using the, you see, the XPB. So the drill tool uh, will be transformed into a torque tool thanks to the RFID heads technology. Now I need to respect the specific sequence. So to tighten the right temporary fastener in the right sequence to ensure the right clamping of the drill jig. I send the information on the part for the operator and on the process control software. Now I'm sure the drill jig is fully and correctly installed. Now, critical step, manual drilling using the SETITEC EDU. And to do this, we'll be able to select the right cycle. We'll be able to force the different uh, steps and the different positions of the drilling on the drill jig. I'm in the right position. I've got the right head. And now, and only now, can I launch the cycle. Cycle is launched. The information is sent to the database, is sent to the meter. And if I try to read drill in the same position, impossible. OK. Next, I will finish my drilling operation and be able to move to the tightening step with the EPB. In that instance, the operator will be able to tighten the different fasteners in any order. So that's a free sequence and will select the right cycle depending on the position. And then my position is absolutely closed. Last but not least, we'll be able to use our EABS with its Salter's crow foot, indexable crow foot, to tighten the last solution, the last position. Again, geolocated. If we look at what these tools have been generating, they've sent all the information to this dashboard, okay? So here, this is an example only on Titany tools, where you will see that all the data that have been generating by the drilling, tightening, manual tools, fed into this database for traceability and process improvement. We are able to generate the alerts that are linked to any defect uh, which is identified in the process, and send this information to the right people at the right time uh, in the factory. So this was the Suta Aerospace uh, ecosystem in a nutshell. So just a couple of examples of what our technology can bring and can be used to improve your processes. Thank you very much for your time and looking forward to hearing from you soon. Thank you.